So today we are going to be learning how to have your one WhatsApp account cloned onto your laptop or onto your computer. So you can be able to transfer files and document to and from both devices very easily. So this is my WhatsApp account and I am going to be making sure that I have this particular account cloned onto my laptop for me very quickly. So what I need to do very quickly on the computer is to go ahead and then open your browser. Now, if you are using the Mac just like I am using, sometimes you cannot be able to have this done using the Safari. So you can go ahead and then have Google Chrome application installed. So once you have got it, please go ahead and then have it opened. now in the search bar you are going to be searching for web.whatsapp.com 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 and right here this is it and you are going to tap it open or if you have typed in the dot com you are going to be having it fully opened just like it is coming right away So once you have been able to have that opened, please go ahead and then tap onto settings in your WhatsApp account. And just as you've tapped onto settings, you are going to tap onto linked devices and you are going to tap onto link a device. So you are basically going to scan the code that has popped up on your laptop or on your computer, just like I am doing right now. And within a couple of seconds after the scan has been successful, it will be accepted. And this is what is going to follow up. So once you have been very successful with the link, this is basically what is going to pop up on your phone. And then if I go onto my chat, you should be able to see some of the features available right here, as you can see. And then on my laptop also, you can clearly see some similarities as well. As you can see through on my phone, the chat is very the same on my laptop as well. So I have received this particular image or message in this particular group with the name work. And then if I go onto my laptop, you can see that this particular account or WhatsApp group has also received the same item that has come in here. And you can clearly see that for yourself. So basically, this is how it works to link your WhatsApp device onto your laptop. So you can be able to share documents from one device to another very quickly. And I must state categorically that you are going to be linked for a very long time if you have been able to go through this successfully. And please, if there are any issues that you face anytime you are trying to do this, leave that in the comment section and I'll be able to address that properly. And let me walk you through some of the features that you need to expect or in order for you to go ahead and then do a lot more just like you do with your normal WhatsApp account. Right here we have the status option where you can be able to watch status if you want if you are done with anything you have the cancellation option right here for you to go ahead and then cancel that we have the messaging option where you begin a new message with your contact your new group your new community or you are going ahead to have any of the names set in order for you to go ahead and then have a message sent to them if you want just like you normally do with your whatsapp account you can go back by tapping onto the back option and then you have other options right here available if you tap onto the three dot it is basically the menu option on your normal whatsapp account and just like you can see you can be able to log out anytime if you want you go on to settings in order to have your status customization search or in order to have your profile picture updated and all that if you want so basically that's been it thank you and please subscribe for more lessons like this in the coming days